All right, Alpha Quadrant. So we're now in the this the Star Trek universe. We're now in the Alpha Quadrant. All right, so there's a Baron of something here. Oh wait, that, that guy has red pants. Oh shit, and he fires red projectiles. It, it's col it's color matching to a whole new level. Hey. He just looks like a tankier version of the other guy, which is ironically the exact same kind of theme that they had the other time. Can this guy just die? I, okay, he's dead now. He's dead forever. Alright, these guys fire also project- Okay, what is it with the, the fucking- the color matching these guys? They had quite the designer. Alright, we need a blue key for that door. <laughs> I had one job. What the fuck did I do now? Anyways, like I like I said, they they have matching outfits. All right, they they nailed the important stuff down. You know, I probably shouldn't use my my uh, super shotgun on these guys now that I actually learned that I have to actually attempt to conserve ammo. Although ironically, those guys just gave you fifty fucking shots, so who cares? We can now waste it all we want. Actually, I just noticed that the shotgunners and the regular guys look exactly the flip and same. Oh my god, there's like a row of them. I actually- I can't stand the sounds. The sounds are actually atrocious for these guys. <laughs> Like, I actually could not think of more uninspiring sound effects for those guys dying. Here, I'll, I'll do my impression of it, okay? It sounds like a dying fucking whale, okay? Roar, like, fucking... Dude, they all sound the same, too. It's like the, the same guy just, like, making noises into the microphone. Alright, whoever that sound designer is, I hate him automatically. Alright, so the sound is not the memorable part of uh, Doom 64. They unenthusiastically die. I mean, he's like, he's kind of just like, okay, yeah, I have to die now, but I don't really want to. Only because you're making me, Doom guy. You know, I have to ask you guys, is this, is this in the, is this in the fucking Doom canon at all? I know that, I know the Doom canon is like, meme as shit, but you know. Is this like, like a... Well, I mean, it kind of—I guess it kind of is because, spoiler, I know that the Unmaker is in this game, which is which was unironically supposed to be kind of like the original implementation of the BFG. Is that chain gun actually good? I mean, the chain gun was always good. You take that back. Oh, hey guys, it's a, a megasphere or whatever the hell, hell it is. Oh, I see what I'm supposed to do. I'm supposed to figure out a way up here and then run across because there's a hole in this guy unless there's like a one sec how the fuck do i get over here so it's thinking like like dude are you kidding like 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 the doom guy can't jump memes or something else like it's at literally at fucking like waist height and i'm like nah i refuse to go up there all right let's just let's just start mashing walls until something opens okay no All right, I'm 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 actually upset right now. Try jumping, carrying all the ammo and shit. You know what? Are you you don't need to fat shame me, okay? Doom guy has several problems. All right, it just feels like it's something over there. Cause look at that hole that I see over there. Maybe it's something like over here somewhere. What the fuck, dude? Doom guy just wants his mega sphere, whatever the fuck. All right, I picked up a clip, guys. <laughs> Go to the get get triggered. Oh shit. And and like when, when these guys spawn it sounds like they're orgasm, honestly. <laughs> I mean actually most of the sounds are just people orgasm, honestly. Even when they die.
Doom Golf is canon? I hope it is. It better be. Alright, so there's a yellow key card and uh, a backpack. Oh shit. Oh dude, he memed me. What the fuck? The hell? So I, I just found like a secret unintentional. Oh, wait. Oh! Alright, let's go. Ugh. No, you fucker! Alright, so we've obviously failed on a monumental level for this game. Dude, I, I thought I would just run across and then win. Alright. Because it was like, I opened it, I opened it, I triggered this thing somehow. Dude, how did I do it? How was I such a boss before and then I didn't do it this time? What was the trigger before? It's like one of those stupid one-ass, one-time doors. Oh, here we go. This goes over here this way. Dude, how did I do this before? Oh god, this is so idiotic. I, I don't even know what the trigger is for that door. Maybe it's something over here. I didn't even realize I, I had triggered that. I thought it was just something I was idiotic. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's where the trigger is. Alright. Alright, so let's try and strafe over. Fuck. Dude, that's so hard. What the fuck, dude? How do you do this on an N64 controller? Alright, so I figured out where the trigger point is. It's like, uh, it's in the, it's in the video comments of this, uh, series. Um, and also, alright, so what the fuck does it want me to do? Does it want me to, like, go around? Dude, N64 gamers are hardcore. Oh, shit, I did it. Look at that. Dude, you have to straight front on an N64 controller, guys. That's all you have to do. Alright, we got it. Actually, that looks like a secret over here. No. Dude, so many things look like doors, but they're not, but then they are doors, and then they're not doors, and then they're sort of doors, and then they're not doors. I th wasn't Doom at SNES's problems, wasn't that all in, like, the fact that the music was, like, literally trash? It just, it just sounded like, a, like, it was coming out of, like, John Carmack's asshole, like, the, the whole soundtrack. I don't, I don't know why that's where my mind went to, but you know. It, it was something about, like, the SCNS had a really bad time doing any kind of sound emulation whatsoever. It looked terrible, too. I mean, it was a pretty garbage, like, tech... tech nice. What is it? What do you want me to do here? Uh, that's fucking weird, but how do you get rid of this? I guess I guess one of these other switches removes that platform. Or I go in here and... Fucking asshole. <laughs> Alright. Now let's try this out. <laughs> we... Oh, it does, it does like a... Oh shit, what, what the fuck? Okay. Alright, here we go. I want to use a rocket launcher. Oh, <laughs> I'm apparently out of, fuck. What's the key for this? It's five. Okay, dude, I could not imagine anything more painful than having to switch weapons with a fucking D-pad or whatever the fuck you did with this. You can't just go. Where's my? Where's my? Where's my shotgun? And now I'm having great difficulty figuring out how to get around here. I on. I quite honestly, I am I not auto running. No, oh, no, I am auto running. It's on. I'm having great difficulty, like figuring out how to get across gaps. I'm not. I'm not. I'm, not, I'm actually not kidding at all. <laughs> it's actually difficult. Like I have to. Stra I have to strafe, strafe run into everything, and I'm like, what the hell, dude? I'm, all I'm saying is, like, N64 players, hardcore as fuck. All right, all those millions of years of fucking playing Mario Party. Okay. There's nothing here. I like the mm, noise. Actually, that's bad too. Honestly, what happened to what happened to Doom Guy's manly oof? That was the best part. That's the best part of everything. Oh, you had to play this shit with the N64 controller. All right, you know what? I have a question to ask. How many people actually played this on the N64? I know. That, I know. I know. There's a number of boomers, probably. 
Oh shit. Oh. Like, the console boomers, nonetheless, the filthiest of boomers. All of you? Okay. Literally everybody but you. Thanks, thanks a lot. Literally everybody but me has played this on the controller. So I'm, I'm having the first, this is like Terraria, this is just my first time. Alright. Oh, the one guy did. Serious Kaka didn't play it on N64. Oh my god, these guys are horribly uh, kicking my ass. Okay, can you can you go down? Thank you. Can I just rocket launcher them again? These these do these hold mana or something? I, I wonder what the difference is with the red projectiles. If there is a difference. Nintendo was really expensive, I know. I think the cartridges for that were like a hundred and something dollars. And then like, at least in Canadian dollars. I remember it being expensive as hell. This may have contributed to the reason why my parents never bought me Nintendo shit. And then I became a PC gamer, so. Oh fuck, sorry, I did stray for him. Yeah, I think I... What the fuck is that noise, honestly? I haven't saved it, by the way. Dude. Oh, shit. Yo, this game just tried to meme me. What the hell's this? What the fuck is that? What? <laughs> uh. Oh, it's pinkies in an underground setting. I mean, I can kind of see them. It's just enough light. Maybe the, the that's pain elemental. So they, they kind of like what they kind of swap the they 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 swap the pain elementals with the cacodemons, I guess. Because now the cacodemons have arms. It's really freaking weird. What, it gave me berserk. Let's do berserk. Oh wait, that's not berserk at all. I can't. I actually can't tell what weapon I have right now. Um. Oh my goodness. I haven't used this yet, but it's fucking weird. Zzz. It sounds like it sucks it sounds like I'm it sounds like I'm killing them with wasps. <laughs> no, not the bees. No, it totally is the ch that, that thing. <laughs> like it, uh, constantly. This is actually pretty good against pinkies, honestly. I don't know how normally loud it is, but you know. It feels like it's louder than everything else in this unforsaken game. <laughs> you, you know, I have to say, I, I actually like the sound effect of that, but that's not changed from Doom 1, so... Let's not even say that's that's something that they did, because it totally isn't. Alright, how the fuck do I get out of here? Now begins... The great adventure of figuring out where the fuck to go. Oh wait, oh, this is stairs. Oh my god, that's so weird. <laughs> it's, like a, it's like a one pixel staircase <laughs> for me to go up. That's a, that's incredible, I love it. Oh shit, I fell off it. Time to go up the staircase again. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out how to... Actually, I could just... Why am I putting effort into this? Just go over here. Because everything is priced in Canada. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty accurate. It's, it's really weird because when our economies are the same, they're like, well, people are pay still paying this, so we're not going to drop the prices at all. And then when like things get more expensive, they're like, well, too fucking bad. You have to, we're raising the price now. They're, they're real pricks, actually, in this country, honestly. What the, why would it bring me up? I don't know. Can't I just run across like this? I guess I kind of can. Kind of like, I guess it brings you up just to make it easier to go across. Do it, how do I get this Mega Sphere? Then? Or it's not Mega Sphere, it's a Mega Health, sorry. It's a, it's a Sphere of Mega. Alright. Oh, you might probably do. I probably have to jump over to this one over here from some from one of those ones. So let's do that. Let's do it. 
Oh my, what the hell? Oh shit. Fell down again. Okay. At least that sounds kind of normal with the monsters. Oh, what the? Okay. This is some shit where I'm just supposed to walk walk towards it, not like run straight. There you go, that's that's it. I was overthinking this problem. Oh my god, they're right here. One sec, we need to bring out the we need to bring out the B gun. The soul sphere. Oh that's what it is. Listen, I don't know the name of anything, okay? <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't judge me. Or, or judge me, I don't, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> yeah. That's what I'm here for. This is the this is the gamer way. Alright, so I can now get this ar Mega armor. Actually, it is mega armor, literally. I didn't actually know that was a name. Everything's a mega something or a something sphere or something. Or a mega soul sphere or some shit. Is there any reason that I had that? I don't think so. Alright, so we did all that and we got um, a yellow key card. Fuck, why is this so zoomed in? Alright, let me scroll out ever so slightly. Whatever. Oh. Super awesome. I don't think I don't think they ever use that terminology. God, why do the red pants guy they they just they, they're so tanky. It's because of the red pants. They're just so cool. Alright, now they're dead. But they're still cool, because they still have their red pants. It's, that's the one thing I can never get rid of. Alright. Sweet. We have now finished the Alpha Quadrant. Oh, back to 100% secrets. You know, actually, this is not this is not bad level design to be honest. You have the, you have like the space background, and like this thing coming up. So uh, you know, I was shitting on the level design before, but actually, it's actually not that bad. I mean, okay, it's not always intuitive, but in terms of like what they did with the tech, it's still pretty. It's pr actually pretty fucking cool. Ah. Alright, so where do we go? I mean, I honestly don't like the door texture some of the time. That's actually my main issue with it. And if door textures is the biggest thing I could say about the level design, then you know. Oh, uh, it's also the fact that sometimes- oh shit. I get that going. All right, so how do we? So this is not a case where we can just uh, strafe run to it now. Oh shit, they're in cages now. We're in the imp zoo. Oh wait, no, this is not imps. Are you? Do you notice like with this new graphics, like the imps actually have like six packs? All right, they fucking they're swole as fuck actually. It's honestly only something I would notice. Need the health kit. You're you're in the Hell Gimp Museum. Also, the stars don't parallax when you turn. Oh, I may not have noticed that. That's a that's a complaint I had about a recent uh, Duke Nukem 3D mod I did, where a lot of backgrounds weren't doing that either. I mean, it's it's a 1997 game. Come on, you can't just shit on it. I say, uh, I'd ironically. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck man. Roar. I totally hit the thing over there. What the hell? Can't just uh hit me like that. Dude, it's the it's the guy. It's the guy who did the frickin' maze rooms. He came back with a vengeance. Alright, so, I, oh wait, it's showing me something here, that's why. Oh, hey, made a bridge. Nice. 
That's now that's good. Not not the shit we saw before where it's like, oh hey, something changed on the map, go fucking figure it out, nerd. Not no 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 that's good. Like there was actually a screen there and I saw the button behind me. And then I pressed the button and then we all had a good time. We all knew what happened. Rawr. Is that a t that's a time door. No, it's not actually, I lied. Um, what? Oh shit. Probably this? The guy who did the messed up the Doom 2 maps? He's back now. Oh man, who was the guy who hated the Doom 2? Who was the guy who made all the horrible Doom 2 maps? I, I don't remember his name. I remember Wikidoo telling me about him, and he's like, yeah, he has a reputation for, uh, uh, for obviously quality. Did it? That's the biggest troll I've ever seen. It, it just, it just knocked me. I, now I gotta go back there. You did, you just did, it just lowered the platform as I walked, stepped away from it and then revealed more health. Like, like a, okay, I hate this guy now. He did. He did pretty good with the uh, with the the door switch, but everything else, oh god, why would he do this to me? Watch it be unobtainable. Okay, no, it's not. Oh, supercharge. Why did it? Did it just? Yeah, it just gave me more vision for some reason. I don't even know. Why. Also, I I know there's a button here. Actually, what am I doing? I can just shoot it until I can't shoot it. Yeah, remember I can't look up and down, so... Okay, so apparently I can, this is not a button I can press. I kinda want that guy's gun. Alright. I actually have no idea how to lower that thing. Yeah, I think there's nothing I can do. John Romero? Was it actually John Romero? No. Was it? I think you guys are fucking with me. I thought he had a reputation for being good at this shit. Yeah, no, that's what I thought. He, he didn't do much on Doom, or Doom 2, sorry. I say Doom, John Romero. Apparently during development of Quake, John Carmack made a program to measure how much time <laughs> Romero played deathmatch instead of doing work. Oh, dude, Plasma Gun. Oh, nice. That looks like a BFG. And it has this really annoying ambient sound effect that I could honestly do without. This is honestly the most unsatisfying Plasma Gun I think I've ever played with. <laughs> Not only is it... Uh, not not appealing visually, but it's not appealing to my ears either. It just sounds like there's something wrong with my uh, earbuds. I'm using earbuds right now because uh, I'm just gonna go away from that because I actually hate it on several levels right now. My headphones broke, so I have to use this stuff. The key is that in case I want to use this thing. Okay. You need a red key. Oh, I see. It's got the red crap around it. Oh, well, it looks like we're going into the, uh, the under something. Alright, well, I'm going to say we're not going to go down there. Okay, let's go down there. Oh, yeah, you just got to go back up here, huh? Alright, well, we can't, I don't think we can do anything here, so let's just head back. You weren't crazy about the Doom 2016 pl uh, pl uh, rifle, plasma rifle, it sounds so puny. I mean, I thought it was amazing. That's not a button that does anything. I thought it was good. Um, I The Doom 3 plasma rifle I didn't like. Um, the Doom Eternal plasma rifle is top notch, but... I don't know, it, 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 Doom 1, it was, it's extremely satisfying. Also, that button I can trigger it again, but I don't know what it unlocks. Unlocks my, my curiosity, that's what it does. Let me listen. 
I think it's something on the other opposite side, actually. No. Dude, that's such a dickhead fucking thing to do. What the hell? What? What is that doing? Oh, wait, maybe it's like... Maybe it's the thing over here. No. Who the hell even knows? Dune 3 was your favorite because of the sound? What the pew 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 pew? I mean, actually the reload sound for that was pretty boss. I, I just remembered about that. But that's the one thing I liked about it. They I mean, I mean, you know what, for most of the Doom games, you can't really talk about the sound being bad, except for this one, I guess. Um, I am just fucking utterly lost. Okay, well, it's probably in the blue door somewhere, but fucking... John Romero did a hangar, toxic refiner, nuclear plant, almost all the episode 1 levels. They're pretty good. Actually, there's this thing that- oh, this is where brought me. Are you kidding? It brings me up there just to have me press a switch. <laughs> Did I unlock that? No. Did I unlock the other things? Oh my god. Fucking... Alright. Let's see if I unlock the other one here. Or does it just do random ones? No. So I'm gonna guess maybe that's what that one does. The other- if I don't find an unlock for that switch, then we'll kinda know what that does then. Okay, so where was the yellow key card door? Fuck. It's all zoomed in. Because it resets my zoom on every level. Actually, I think it was up there. Yeah, I see it there. Okay. Uh, just for science. Um... We all love science. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna press it and we're gonna run that way. Not that way. Oh wait, it's right here. Oh, it just locked me in. Oh, okay, I can't lock it. So that's what that thing did. That I didn't even I, I didn't honestly I didn't even notice the armor there. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I, I thought it would have unlocked something later in the level. Fuck man. Why is there the reload sound but not the animation? Uh, I was already just complain. I was just complaining about that earlier. The an the animation left a little bit to be desired. Someone was saying it's because of the cartridge size. I'm not sure if that's the case because these are two two D sprites. I'm gonna say they had an intern doing the animations for these. He was paid by the frame, and he still didn't do a whole lot. Oh, hey, it's a thing, but can't I just go on the side here and not take damage? Yeah. So, checkmate game. And I just... So wait, I, I can still pick up armor bonuses even though I'm at 200? So it just it just gets sucked into the air there, like that's it? <laughs> oh shit. You know what? You know what I think. I think. I think if you put like the sound effects of these guys into like a sound analyzer, speed it up by like by like a factor of ten, it'll make gotchy sound noises. Okay, I'm telling. I'm I'm calling it now. All right, they were ahead of their time. They were ahead of the memes. Uh, how the fuck do I? No, it's not one of the shooty switches. Why the fuck is there a thing in the way there? Alright. Fuck, dude, where... <laughs> what is this shit? Where the fuck do I go? Uh... You, you know what? I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna figure out what the solution is here, and then the, my first reaction is gonna be, that's fucking stupid. Just, just you wait. I'm already foretelling it. Yeah. No, it's not nothing over there. Because it has to be in this room, because this is the yellow keycard room, you understand? That's fucking stupid. Oh my shoulder. Dude, if I if I ever become a game developer, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna just put some hidden gotcha noises in and it's gonna basically be a... So what, this one doesn't open? Fucking...
this one opens, but the other one doesn't. Oh shit, what's this thing? It's a, uh, you know, I, I would honestly not take this, the, the, the biohazard symbol, but you know what? No, I actually really didn't need this because they had the little edges where I, I don't have to take damage, so. Which is really nice of this guy. Apparently, Senator Peterson. You're talking about Sandy Peterson, the, the the infamous man who made obviously the best two maps. Is Mormon. You know that, that probably doesn't make a whole lot of sense when you think about it. All right, so I just got. Did I actually? What did I achieve here? I think I just unlocked the thing up there. That's what I did. There we go. And oh wow, it's open now. And that just opened that door. All right, I take what I, I take back what I said about the level design. I hate it again. I liked it for a second. Oh, and, oh, and you were just talking about how there's no parallax, parallax scrolling in the background. You're right, there isn't. It's just kind of stuck. Yeah, you know what? Honestly, I wasn't even paying attention to that. Okay, never mind. Stana's good. Fuck this game. Nah, just kidding. Uh, but anyways. Nah, we won't shit on the game that much. Just a, just most of the time. You know, I didn't even realize what the gimmick with this level was, which is that you could see all the keys from the spawn. Alright, so where's the red key card? Red is the color of... Um, fuck if I know. Happy to make you aware. Yeah. Oh wait, it's right, this stuff. I don't know why I went through this again. I, I'm pretty sure all it did was just raise the bridge there. Even though it's not really telling of the fact it did that, I'm just gonna assume it did. I'm gonna use my ultra gamer instincts to both not say derogatory terms and also to know that this opened. Okay, cool. I should probably stop using the super shotgun for literally everything. All right. Cool, we did it. How many secrets do we get? 99% of items. 25% of secrets. Wow. The worst score yet. Oh, dude, it's the final outpost. Alright, guys, this may be the... This might be the end. You have to fight the... Um... These guys. Oh, they infight too, which is nice. Okay. Uh, that's it for final outpost, guys. I'll see you get later. Okay, what kind of trash is this? Was I was I supposed to die or something? Was there supposed to be some kind of like... What the fuck? Was I supposed to die? Did, did I softlock the game by not dying? What? Oh. What? <laughs> I was gonna I was gonna say because that's not an impossible situation to get out of. What? Why the fuck did it it's the odd one out light? Oh, it's a dimmer light to get out. Okay. I listen, I'm colorblind. Uh, well I'm not, but Let's just say, I'm, I'm just, no, sorry, I'm just regular gamer blind. That's, that's what we're going to call it. I, I want to actually go back to that room and see what the fuck I was doing wrong. Oh, shit. I'm being bombarded with purple fireballs. I don't feel that way about Barney the dinosaur. All right. Oh, shit. Call it streamer madness. No. Just gamer blindness. It's fine. This is this is why this is why they have those yellow glasses. It's to help with gamer blindness. Okay, that's what they're for. All right, don't judge. I, I I just I just don't have those glasses. That's the problem. I I need a pair of those guys. 
Five dollars a month, like five fucking gift classes. <laughs> fucking. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Twitch saw the vegan stole it. <laughs> oh, it just spawned a bunch of shit behind me. Oh, it changed the base too. Cool. I think it changed the base. No, yeah, it did change the base. Oh shoot, that's actually pretty sweet. I actually like this. It's cool. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck! Oh wait, there's a blue key card here. It's all good. Oh. Oh hey, the teleporter goes down and brings me back here where I can now open this door. So we can't we can't just reach over and get this? Okay, I guess we can't. It's a little bit difficult. Oh shit, there's a maze here. Uh, I'm not oh shit. You know it'd be slightly more uh well, looks like we get a looks like we gotta switch to the Static nails on the chalkboard gun, which is what I'm gonna call it now. A box of rockets. You know, I, I literally don't use the rockets at all in this game. Uh, mostly because I think I'm never in a situation where I actually want to have them. Like, why would I use it in this case? Actually, I'll use it in this case. I just feel like I have to use the ammo. That, that's honestly the only reason. Oh, here we go. Nice. Is there anything else to this level actually right over here? No, I guess not. It, just, it was just a giant fucking room with all this stuff. Which is, hey, that's A-OK. -okay. okay, listen to this music. What what in the everlasting fuck is that music? <laughs> it's not even music. It's like it's it's like ambient noises. Come on, man. Come on. They they okay. So I'm gonna say 100. percent They didn't des they didn't hire a music guy for this. There's no way they did. It, it it sounds like it, you know when you're in queue at like some theme park on like some kind of like futuristic ride like a roller coaster or something. That's what it sounds like this is. I mean I'm in queue waiting in fucking line at like Six Flags or some shit. That's what I, <laughs> that's what I'm doing. You know that ambient music. You're just in, in line for something. <laughs> that's the best thing I can think of. That that and what this is. You're at Disneyland, guys. Alright. Where is the red key card door? I have no recollection on where it is. Fuck, I have to zoom out. Not there. See, wait a second. This map... Look at this. In front of me is the blue door. That's not- oh, it, it shows up like that. What the fuck? Yeah, nice map. Um, fuck, dude. Yeah, I don't see anything here, honestly. Is there something in here? Where, where was the red keycard door? Uh, nice fucking map, honk honk. Alright, well, where the... What the hell? Fuck, get me up here. Okay, I, <laughs> I have no idea. The guy who designed the map was probably also the music guy as well. Okay, let's just go in here again, just because I can't think of where else it could be. Fuck, dude. <laughs> Alright. Is this something to do with that? Oh 
my god, what on earth would that do? Oh, you know what it probably does? It does this. You gotta be fucking- it's through a port- fuck. This is actually progression, too. <laughs> oh, here's the red keycard door. The music designer was also the level designer. I'm, I'm, I'm calling it now. We're gonna look at the credits of this game. Give you Pat. It's just give you Pat's name on there. And then Pat's gonna come on. He's gonna tell me the story of that. I used to be a game developer, way back when. I've designed a level as in the music for Doom 64. I'm taking too much splash damage. I have to like, kill this guy the old-fashioned way. He's also the animator. <laughs> <He d> <laughs> just, just another thing we can blame Pat for. Pat has a lot of interesting sagas, let me tell you that, okay? It did just put- did it just put in the cage? What? Am I supposed to just press two- both at once, or what? One second, let me just- Why would it do this? Okay. Oh, wait, wait, when I go here, it goes back up. And then when I go into here, it lowers the gate. That's so weird. What? So I can't, I, I can't, I literally can't, oh wait, can I just shoot it? No. How, how would it expect me to, because this one always raises it, but that, that opens the gate. This one always lowers it, but closes the gate. And then there's this horrible music that I'm hearing again. I, that's an interesting kerfuffle that, that it's putting me into. Because if I go here to raise the gate again, or it, lo it uh, raises the platform, and I come over here and it lowers it and I can't do it, okay. Let's, uh, press the yellow wall outside the room. I mean, that that can't be the solution, is it? No. No, you're not allowed to jump in this game. Everyone knows Doom Guy can't jump. I was thinking maybe you just shoot it, but no, you don't even do that. That's so weird. I mean, I, I get it. It's, a, it's like a puzzle, right? So you see here, and I, I'm guessing you have to like lower the gate some other way. Or what's this thing? No. I mean, there's a, well, I can't even get into the yellow keycard door at this point. Rocket jump? I don't think that's the solution, as much as I'd want it to be. Well, there's this place here. What the hell is this thing? It, did, it just moved a plasma rifle away from me. Oh shit! I don't want to be in that. Okay, thanks. Let's let's go. Let's go to the, let's go to the the nails on the chalkboard again. I on, quite honestly, everything about this guy's sound choices for this entire game, I hate. <laughs> Oh shit, we can lower platforms. Oh, I get it. You know what this is? This is like, I think this is a representation of the, uh, the, the gate, the, the thing over there. Why the fuck is there so many buttons to press? Because maybe you're supposed to do something here and that lowers the gate? I'm, re I'm really reaching here, by the way, guys. Okay, well, let's see, let's see if it changed at all, honestly. Only two tries to get the plasma gun. I mean, I, I imagine doing this on console, holy hell. Is this like, what the fuck is this thing? I have, I have no idea what this is for. <laughs> you didn't get it, Mike? Well, I don't... Is it something to do with the... Oh! It's to do with that. 
Oh, okay. You were supposed to look at the camera to see which. I don't. I don't. I already have a plasma gun. I don't care. I, I get what that, that's for now. Okay, it's that was a puzzle to get that thing. All right. Well, how the fuck do we open the door then? All right, back back into this little fucking head scratcher. Yeah. Yellow panel outside of room. I'm, I'm, I'm being told what to do, but... I don't see a, a yellow panel anywhere, to be honest. I get what you're talking about, I just don't know where it is. It's because it doesn't look like it's this. Or, it is that. Oh. That's so weird! What the fuck? <laughs> Uh, okay, okay. Sorry, guys. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I didn't hear a sound. Okay, I didn't hear a sound for it. What's? Well, I'm really curious about that. What does that make a sound? Or is it, was it just overshadowed by this thing? What? How does that work then? Oh, it lowers the platform. That's what that does. That's so weird. Does it do it when I just press it? What? I, I, I'm really super curious about how that how that works now. Yeah, I have to use it and there's no there's no feedback at all. It it, it just kinda lowers it. Yeah. That's that's what confused the live everlasting shit out of me. Alright, thank <laughs> Thanks serious Kakadu, but like, oh my god. Yeah, it is it is actually the panel. That's what that's what like I thought it would make a noise because the last time I tried it, I was like, oh, it didn't do anything, right? Oh, I don't want that. All right. That's the kind of thing that we secrets not progress. I mean, it, it is what it is. Do I even need to kill these guys? They seem like they're really annoying to have to kill all of these, so... Why waste your ammo on this? Energy cell pack, is that all I came here for? I feel like, you know what, I feel like I'm gonna have to go across these at some point. I oh, know, I already have the red key, never mind, I don't need to talk to these guys, fuck it. I'll romance them later. Alright, so now I have no health, so that's the perfect time to do quick save. Uh, it's to assert dominance over the developers of this. I mean, this one, I have to say, I didn't mind this puzzle. I know I fucked it up, um, but that one was actually good, because that one, like, was, like, I didn't think about it when I saw the, the original thing, but, you know, it's one of those think-outside-the-box kind of deals. So, I can't I can't actually complain about that one, but I'll try anyways. I hate it. No, I'm just kidding. But anyway, uh, so I got a red key card. Uh... Wait, I actually do want to go back to that room that just occurred to me. Fuck. Because <laughs> that, that just occurred to me there's actually nothing else on this level, so every, whatever solution it, it, is there, it's in that room. Quick save at ma one, out, 1 HP for maximum balls. I mean, you know what? I've been known to do that, so... Not like it's bothered me before. I'm uh, just looking at the room here. I don't really care to kill these guys, honestly. They're just tanky and annoying, so... Um... I, I'm pretty sure, uh, you know, maybe I do have to kill these guys, honestly. Yeah, it's just, let's just use the rockets, because I don't ever have a... <laughs> I could... No, I could chainsaw them. Where the fuck's my big gun? There it is. You gotta, th you gotta think like the N64 players, man. You gotta think outside the box. They played Mario Party. Alright. Mario Party was the most hardcore game. Peach was a fucking incarnate of death. Oh, and like it, it actually did open something here, so... My, my slacking off did not pay off, honestly, at all. Uh, that's the end of the level.
blind Yoshi can't find house keys. <laughs> Zero percent secrets. Oh, entering even simpler. All right. 